is discussed in local resort corner. Make one punch! Ladies and gentlemen, we're back. This is our 15th fight of the night. We've got Nathan Hunt from OSTMA fighting in the red corner. Uh, this fight is being held at 66 kilos. Uh, Nathan Hunt will be taking on Callum McDonald, who will be fighting from Halifax MMA. So this is uh, Nathan Hunt from OSTMA walking in right now. See, they're having a bit of a struggle though, getting his hoodie off. Those are big MMA gloves, causing problems for him. They finally managed to get it done. So Nathan Hunt is saying his goodbyes to his teammates. He'll get the final checks from our uh, referee on the outside, Mr. Alan Jackson. And then he'll step inside to face Callan McDonald. Now representing uh, Halifax MMA, it's uh, Callum McDonald making his walk in uh, with flag on his back. Looks very confident. And uh, he looks the taller of the two fighters from over here, but obviously we'll be able to tell properly once they're both in the cage. So this is Callum McDonald uh, fighting uh, in the blue corner representing Halifax MMA. He'll be taking on Nathan Hunt, who's fighting from OSTMA. And this is a 66 kilo fight, our 15th fight of the night on Battle Arena. So final instructions from our referee, Mr. Paul Nichols. We have Nathan Hunt in the red corner from OSTMA. I've got a great crowd behind him, backing him today at Battle Arena 37. And then we have Callum McDonald from Halifax MMA in the blue corner. So touch your gloves, nice little bit of respect. And we get down to the action. Both open up in a, opening up with kicks, so I'd like to see. Oh, that was a lovely sort of screw left hook right hand and he's really rocked him already. Hey, oh, and a lovely left, left high kick as well. He's opening up and this could be a short night if he lands one of them big bombs. Callum's picking his shots very well. Yeah, Callum's striking was absolutely on point right there. I love that left screw punch with a right hand to follow it. It was absolutely beautiful. And the left head kick as well, straight off that front leg. But, you know, Nathan Hunt did well. He's weathered the storm, managed to shoot in, get the clinch. Now he's got a body lock up against the fence. 
So well done by Nathan, toughing it out. And he's got the takedown. Oh, and he's got reversed, and luckily got a reverse. But <laughs> Callum doesn't want anything to do on the floor. Stand back up. See how we go. So nice body kick straight into a body lock. Interesting combo, but it worked well for uh, Nathan Hunt just there. Indeed. Both fighters in the clinch, to, uh, in the clinch against uh, Callum's corner. So as you can see, Callum is wearing the traditional sort of Thai Muay Thai shorts, and you can definitely see that's the background he's got. He's got excellent Thai striking. Actually, his first strike of the fight was a teep. Yeah, not very often you see that as a first strike. So you know you can tell he comes from a, a Thai boxing background. And it looks like he's got some power for this weight class as well. Oh, most definitely. 66 kilos and, you know, he, he swings. A great pick-up and slam by uh, Nathan Hunt there. Absolutely great pick-up and slam there. So Nathan's now got him on the floor. Let's see what he can do. And again, with this being a B-class fight, they are only shots to the head and the ground. So they are limited uh, into what they could do. So, a little bit of a break there just to fix the glove. I think a finger popped out, probably. Uh, but Paul Nichols spotted it and started it. And now Callum McDonald is actually going for an arm triangle from the bottom. It's not very often you can get this unless you've got a, a tremendous squeeze. But if he managed to rotate it, which he has now, and drops to side control. If he drops down to side control, puts his head on the mat, and he's got it. He gets it from mount position. Impressive performance uh, by Callum McDonald. Very, very impressive performance by Callum McDonald there. And he goes over to the camera as a little bit of a celebration. It's great stuff. I really liked uh, his striking all round. Good kicks, good punches. Same thing with Nathan. Nathan had a few good shots, but uh, I think Callum got the better of uh, the exchanges. And you can see he got the finishes rolling the ground. So that obviously tells you he's a well-rounded fighter. Uh, both fighters put on a great performance. What do you think, Carson? Yeah, definitely. Callum McDonald's striking was crisp. Really, really nice Muay Thai. Um, Nathan Hunt, again, he, he, he stayed in the pocket a little bit and landed a couple of shots, but he did get a little bit wobbled, and I think that's what made him shoot for the takedown. Um, you know, he was doing really well on top, and it was a really unusual sort of position for Callum to find himself uh, in an arm triangle at the bottom, but he uh, managed to reverse it and finish it from mount position. I think... Um, if he, if he works on his ground game just a little bit more, um, he could be a, a really top contender, at, especially at 66 kilos. He's a big guy, you know, and he looks as though he hits pretty hard. So, over to your MC for... Uh, for the decision. Nice little show of respect there at the end, having a little photograph, photograph together. Indeed, that's what uh, this game's all about. Uh, throw down, kick each other, punch each other, and then uh, shake hands after, probably have a beer after that. 100%. Okay, Callum, great victory there. Is it what you expected? Did you train for that particular technique? Or did you just see his opportunity? Give a round of applause. He knows what he wants. It looks like it's okay. 